Let's take a look at this guy. He plays soccer and he's dumb. He has a mask on. Here we have a technician that is uh, upgrading the system for the future 5G antenna. Here is our technician. He is paid very well. He is just doing his job. What's the matter? He is done. He now can close everything. He can go home and sleep peacefully. Like a baby. He just did his job. Hey cow, do you know that you are ill and you must wear the mask? Hey cow, you are ill, you must wear a mask. Now imagine if a lion uh, tells telepathically to a zebra or to uh, one of those animals that he catches. Act like you are ill. Do not move. Do not move because there's a virus around you. You should not run anymore so that I, uh, I can catch you and protect you and cure you with my teeth. This is the, the church, guys. It's very powerful, very lots of money to keep it in order like this and everything, you know? And it says here, the church of, of Jesus Christ and of the saints of the last days. This is uh, a Mormon church, guys. Takes lots of, uh, lots of time and money to, to do such a thing in such a horrible times, guys. With, also with lights, also, look. It, it, it's like I'm ruining everything here, guys, with, with my presence. Look. Me, the, the, the poor, poor piece of shit. The two pillars, you know, of the masonry, you know. Here we have also the golden gate. Yeah. Very humble individuals. And the golden angel. Lucifer. Nothing to see here. Just an expansive building. Go away. Go away with your dirty dirty shoes. Go away. So from this other side we can see another very creepy obelisk and very telling, you know. They are uh, re readjusting. The dick needs some uh, restoring. I don't know if you can say in English restoring, like uh, adjusting it. You know? you know, I think the this other pillar here had the same kind of angel, or not, or maybe another figure, but God maybe threw. Uh, some lightning to, to these monsters and now there is only this one left because if I see the structure of this pillar you know it's the same here for example in this point here it's the same so it's just, it's just missing something here they don't miss money to build whatever they want in that uh, pillar there, M even a dick they will put in our face. This is this is a symbol of the dick, for example. They, being the sheep so blind, they could very well put a dick there, guys, or maybe a, like a fuck you, you know, like like this, you know, fuck you, dumb sheep. Yeah, we have money. What's wrong with that? Creepy monsters. They put the name Jesus Christ here. It's monsters. I want to talk about 
one of my you know uh, when you are uh, in the path of uh, to find the truth you know one thing for sure uh, you will uh, fall in lots of traps one of my latest traps was a certain pastor Anderson Anderson this guy you know was uh, was like captured by the police was stopped by the police you know and he was you know uh, stopped stopped their car and it put him out and uh, and you know uh, almost killed him you know and everything but you know after what happens today in these days you know uh, that could have uh, very well been just uh, theater because you know lately I, I was into all these people that do audits you know they go and uh, in public buildings you know and see how the uh, the police you know will react but to tell you the truth guys I've never I've never seen sheep dare to treat cops like that guys never and in fact uh, I remember uh, a Russian Witz made a video where he showed that one of these people that make uh, cop audits are uh, was a mason and you know and when he saw another cop that was a mason they did the masonic handshake with each other now in front of me guys there is a sheep with a mask on and uh, it would be funny to take a picture of this guy but well it's, 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 you, you, it's better for you that you don't saw it so there's lots of sheep with masks guys it's unbelievable so even though it's not uh, necessary to wear it when you are outside for the moment so uh, so this uh, cop audits also were, was another trap of mine guys in fact I also made a video uh, about uh, you know because I like what, what they were doing you know but only then I realized you know that can you ever see someone like the sheep you know going there and pointing the camera to a cop they would just kill you <laughs> They would just kill you. They, they just wanted to show the people, you know, that look, this is the police. We can do to them whatever we want. They do not touch us, you know. And so, and so, let me, let me quickly, quickly. Uh, <laughs> that's fun, <fantastic. laughs> Um I almost uh, tried to, to, to be human with her, even though they are total sheep, guys. They may be vomit, really, guys. They are not human anymore for me. So, so look at them, guys. Listen, the older they are, the dumber they are, the more, the more cover they are, the more good citizen they are with the mask on, you know. And so. Uh, these are, these are my, my two latest traps, guys. The cop audits, all fake, guys, all fake. Cops can uh, would kill you if they want, and they can get away with it without any problem, because uh, the, the ones that uh, should judge them, you know, are, are bodies, body bodies, all masons, guys. So, and uh, the latest trap, you know, was this, uh, you know, I, I was new into this uh, Bible thing. I was trying to understand the Bible and everything. I watched lots of videos, you know, and read here, read there, you know. And uh, since uh, the videos are easier than reading, you know, you fall into traps, guys. Uh, nobody does videos, you know, just because they like it, the, the subject, guys. I have some insect in my face. So, there's all... There's always uh, something fishy, but when you, when you are at the beginning, uh, in what in whatever uh, thing uh, that you are doing in your life, at the beginning you always uh, make mistakes, you know. But I'm telling my mistakes because uh, if there are people that uh, 
want to want to have some advice maybe you know can be careful in some situation you know I hope this video can be useful for for someone that listens those few ones so uh, this guy you know this uh, uh, Steven Anderson this great pastor you know uh, after this corona BS uh, came into our lives you know, he made a video uh, talking about oh there are these people these conspiracy nuts making videos that this is not true oh, what are you saying you know these these are nuts you know and I couldn't believe I, I, I immediately unsubscribed from his channel you know because really man you should be someone you know that understood all this you know you can't fall after 9-11 man this was the exact copy of 9-11 you know and to see such a guy you know that talks about you know Babylon you know this Babylon that you know America is you know the Babylon that is said in the Bible you know and end times and all this you know then you understand why you know the pictures become more clear you know and you realize these people are there just for the money guys and they don't care to lie to the sheeple guys just to take those money and they for example choose to uh, say that the virus exists because now my friend Joe Briani will explain you why the pastors all need to get thrown into the ocean with a millstone around their neck and they, it needs to be done in the North Atlantic so they can feed the king crabs and the lobsters for us because these guys have ripped us off and now they're sucking in their Donald Trump stimulus checks they're getting three months of payroll expenses now have you ever seen the financials of a church have you ever seen the financials on a church ladies and gentlemen think about this for just a second all right all 501c3 churches do not have to have transparent financials you have no idea how much they can claim that they're paying in payroll and expenses for three months so consequently uh, that information is not available to the public and they can make up anything they want and go to the uh, Donald Trump stimulus plan and get three months of operating expenses tax-free in the form of a grant now can you get three months of operating expenses for your household tax-free in the form of a grant from the government right now no you get freaking 1200 bucks right three months of operating expenses that's all the fat on the payroll all the insurance all the all the fake expenses and by the way, I've seen the tax returns on Christian schools. They are a fraud. These Christian schools, nothing but crooks. Do the math. They're all waiting for their check, too. All these Christian churches, all the nonprofits. The reason I'm focusing on the churches is because they're the biggest criminals of all. Because they come in the name of Jesus Christ. Christianity is that it's not pain-free 
And in teaching about offenses, I found it very effective to mention the kinds of offenses that come in Scripture. The word offense in the Greek is scandalon, and it refers to the bait of a trap. This is an old Texas rat trap, and uh, I've smashed many a finger on this thing trying to show this message. And when you put the bait on this trigger, that trigger is called the scandalon. That's the offense. And if you reach for the offense to be offended because you are, uh, uh, an animal reaches for it to eat it, but a Christian reaches for the offense because he's hurt, 